Kevin, thanks for joining us. The first victory is Crawley manager. How would you assess your side's performance today? Yeah, I think um, the group's trained really well um, since we've come in. I think they've come back physically in really good condition. Um, but we've pushed them really hard. We've had lots of double sessions um, and they've put, pushed themselves and their bodies through a lot of pain in the training sessions. Um, and obviously in the performance today, they've taken on some real tactical information that, um, that was applied really well in the game. So I was really pleased overall. Um, I think um, you know, we could have scored a couple more goals. Um, we could have penetrated the, the final third a bit, bit more, but we had a block of work from the first training session to this week, which was around our build up and our high pressing. And, um, you know, the goal came from a high press um, and so many, you know, situations when we built up from the back very well. So those two areas were really important in the last week or so. We haven't really worked on create the attack and finish the attack yet. So we're really happy with how they did today. Yeah, it was a very professional performance, wasn't it? Lots of passing, you know, we had the majority of the possession for the whole game. And as you said, that's something that you're going to be wanting to drill in early doors, isn't it? Of course, it? yeah. I mean, we, we um, set the... We set the, the, the groups and targets before the game, what we wanted to, to do um, with the ball, and, um, and they did it really well. Um, so, you know, we can't ask any more from that. The application out of possession was also very good. There are some uh, small things that w we need to do, improve on, um, but that will come. That will come with um, more time with us, uh, more fitness, um, and obviously adapting to different surfaces in 3G today was, um, was something that they had to get used to, but I thought they really coped well and really pleased with everyone today. Yeah, I suppose the beauty of pre-season is that you were able to field 21 different players today and, you know, get some get some legs in, you know, the lads that are here and also some trialists as well. Yeah, of course. And, it, you know, the, we mixed the, the, the teams and um, some trialist um, boys have been training with us and, and have done well um, and they played and they, some of them did very well. And, um, you know, it's really pleasing that some of the senior players also was, was excellent um, in, in the game today. Um, George, when he came on, midfield... Jack Payne, um, Tom Nichols, I thought was first class in the first half. Um, some really good performances. Um, Quezzy got his goal really well, worked really hard. Um, Tony Craig was, was excellent at the back and really marshalled, but also shown his football intelligence when he was asked to step in. And so some, You can go through most of the team and they all performed very well. Yeah, it was good to see Travis Johnson and Don Telford, you know, make their debuts with the club, both put in good shifts. I suppose maybe a little bit too early for Dion and James, who obviously we welcomed earlier this week, but we're off to Spain tomorrow, so that would be a good chance to, you know, get some proper minutes into their legs. Yeah, of course, you know, you have to um, periodise each individual in, um, to make sure in their physical capacity they're able to, to be fit and they're able to compete at the level that we need. If we wanted to play them today, it's, it's not the right decision. They haven't trained um, for a number of days and to throw them in a game is just... It's um, irresponsible so yeah we, we want to get them on the pitch but we, it takes time they need three or four you know um, training sessions at really good uh, level and then when we, we think they're ready to play games they, they will and um, really good additions to our squad. Yeah and I mentioned there a trip to Spain tomorrow obviously it's a little bit unheard of here but I suppose that's the level of professionalism that we're looking to bring to the club aren't we? Yeah it's, it's really important in terms of um, team building and we're going to get away we're going to be doing double sessions we're going to be working really hard um, we've got really good training facilities. So many football clubs go there um, to in their training camps and winter breaks to, to train at a high, a high uh, performance centre. And we're really fortunate um, and we had the backing from the owners to be able to do that this season. And um, I think the, the players that are on the trip will really enjoy it, but we'll be working really hard. There's no doubt about that. Kevin, thanks for joining us. Pleasure. Take care. Crazy, thank you for joining us. A first win in pre season. Must be delighted. Yeah, nice to get off the mark, um, you know, 1-0 win away from home on the Astro, you know, it's nice to come away, everybody feeling good and, you know, back to training now and on to a good week ahead. Yeah, first 45 minutes for you and a goal as well, obviously, you might not describe that as one of your finest finishes, but, you know, you've got to, you've got to press high, haven't you? Yeah, well, that's the gaffer style, you know, he's come in and he wants the strikers to press from the front, really aggressive, and obviously that's how that goal's come about, so it's nice that one of the traits that he's trying to instill in us has come off today in the game, so, um, yeah, delighted about that and onwards and upwards. Yeah, how have your first you know, week of pre-season been? It's been tough, you know, we've been working hard on, on the things the manager wants to do. Of course, with any new, new manager, they've got their style and their tactics that they want to impose on the team. So we've been on the training pitch working hard and trying to take in that information and today we got a chance to show in a game how we digested that and hopefully was happy with how we did. Yeah, it was a very professional performance in the second half for the team that you played in, obviously. We spoke to Kevin just before and he agreed. There was a lot of passing, wasn't there? It wasn't necessarily about trying to create the most most chances in the game, but there was a lot of possession, wasn't there? 
Well, that's the style as well. You know, we want to dominate the ball. The more that we're on the ball, the less that they've chance they've got of scoring, really. So. We were really good at keeping it today, linking the passes, everybody finding the rotations and, and picking up the pockets to try and get the balls up the pitch as, as quickly as we can, but also as effectively as we can as well. Yeah, it was a good chance for you to link up with Otte and Don Tell for our new signing today as well. It was very nice, you know, we've, we've obviously all rotated during training to work with each other, but of course being in a game is where you sort of feel the natural the link-ups and stuff like that, and it was, it was a joy to play with them today. Trip to Spain tomorrow, you must be pretty excited about that. Should be good fun. Let's just leave it there. Should be good fun, but a lot of hard work, of course. Yeah, and obviously QPR next weekend. I suppose Spain's just a chance to get some like proper, like warm weather training, warm min more minutes into the legs, and you know we'll be kicking off against the home crowd there. Yeah, it's another chance for the gaffer to instill his his methods and his tactics on us. Obviously, bonding as well as a group is going to be important. So those things are important as well. Travelling away and staying in a hotel together and those things like that. So yeah, it'll be nice to integrate the new lads and get to know everyone a bit better. So we're looking forward to it. Cool. Quasi, thank you for joining us. No worries, gents.